Downtown Henderson is building a little oasis between concrete and brick. It's made of wood and it has a little shade and a big piece of art is on the way. Eyewitness News' Stuart Hammer takes us there. The idea was just to uh, create a space that would jumpstart this section of town. Framed in historic Henderson, a quaint retreat built into the side of 2nd Street. A small thing can really change things a lot. I think we've seen that in downtown recently. An outpost for nature and a sliver of shade on a hot summer day. A simple solution to rev up a part of downtown ready to grow. I look forward to maybe sometime in the future of having a block party here where a lot of people can gather and we maybe could close the street. The perch, this place is called, has the possibility of progressing the city. This project is almost complete. It just needs a finishing touch on Hilliard Lyons' side. But that's easier said than done. As we know, art is very subjective to all in that we may have expectations of what we like in art. An artist has an idea of what to paint, but not every city commissioner is pushing this palette. Today, a committee over the pocket park decided to revisit the design and incorporate new elements from home. It wasn't a final design by any means, but just a concept for what we were looking for to have a nice piece of artwork on this building. With your help, committee member Donna Stinnett feels this place has promise. We were discussing ways that we could address their concerns and maybe incorporate some of their ideas. The great thing about art is it gets people talking. And when you get people talking, good things happen. Just to kind of generate a place for people to be. In Henderson, Stuart Hammer, Eyewitness News. And the first committee says a final design on the mural should be decided by next Tuesday. Landscaping will be added in the coming weeks.